Okay, it's official. We now have 245 subscribers. I'd like to thank her or him, whoever it is. I don't know your name because I didn't get a thing in the email. So if you would like a shout out, please hit the comments and tell me who you are. But for now, I'd like to thank my 244, Natalie Annabella. Annabella. Thank you for being a patriot. Natalie and uh, the new subscribers, you could be 246 if you hit that subscribe button. The place where all the, where all the patriots go. Up next, I'm coming up, is going to be Hulk Hogan at Donald Trump's New York rally. And let's see what he has to say. Thank you, subscribers. Hit the like. Hit the subscribe. And after you hit subscribe, hit the bell. And hit all. And every time I upload, you'll see. I upload news every day. Trump news mostly. And like I said, a sh big shout out to Natalie Annabelle. I told you, Natalie, I'd give you a shout out next time. Here you go. If you get the, the shout out, please get so tell me in the comments. To design a shirt that captures the perfect balance between length and fit. You know the, the deal we wait for the commercials to go off, then I put it up there. So sorry the commercials are longer than I, I wanted to get to my I'm Jay Jackson. My pleasantries out first. And my new subscribers to a shout out. Lincoln, you've been killing it again as normal. Everybody on Lincoln, thank you very much for the likes and the comments. You guys must all be patriots too. The future. The way you see it is set Twitter, not so much. But you know what? There's still time. I'll be here with you until the end of the election. Giving you updated news, breaking news, and everything else. Here. My channel is a variety channel. I have my all original music videos I did myself. You can listen to them. They're on the channel. Just browse through the videos. I like doing funny tricks and games, and eventually we'll do live radio. So what are we all going to do for Halloween, anybody? Please comment what your costume is going to be. I'll see whoever's is the, the best, most creative, I'll give you a shout out. And don't forget, you could be 245. 246, 247, 248, and oh, so on. But if I don't get your name, I will eventually. Give me a nice shout out here. As you hear, I got a little sore throat. I'll be all right, though. Like I said, up next, Hulk Hogan. He's here at um, Donald Trump's New York rally. Here, while we're waiting, we can see us. There you go, tr Trump supporters, patriots. All right, we'll we'll go back to that as soon as it comes on. Just took a break to show you that. I thought that was pretty neat. A little pricey, but I'd like to have a Trumpy trout. So after captivating Marco with this Trump for me. 
opening of speech at the RNC and endorsing Donald Trump, Hulk Hogan, he appeared on stage at Donald Trump's massive Madison Square Garden rally in New York City yesterday. Here's what he had to say. You know, when I hear my president and our president, Donald Trump, speak, he sounds for real, brother. He sounds like he has a heart of gold that's all for the USA. But when I hear Kamala speak, it sounds, yeah, it sounds like a script from Hollywood with a really, really bad actress. We all know Trump is the only man that can fix this country today. And with Trump as our commander in chief, peace through strength will fix all the problems in the Middle East. Here with more wrestling legend himself. What did I say on your shirt? Uh, the one and only legend, Hulk Hogan, is with us. How are you, sir? You are, you are having too much fun out there. I'm great, you brother. To... I still got my Trump pump on, brother, from Madison Square Garden. <laughs> you, you know, I work out. Not that. Not, I'm, I'm not taking you on either. Uh, you were great in one of the Rocky movies, and I remember the size difference. I'm like, oh my gosh, uh, that was brutal. Uh, and then at the end, it was funny. All right, so you said you tapped into something that I think is really relevant. Trump is real. I do interview after interview after interview with Donald Trump. I have one tomorrow with him, and these are not scripted <laughs> answers. And we'll bring these it to you from on the heart. channel. Kamala can't tell, talk about her real views, so she has to hide them. I think that's a big part of why she's not doing well. Your thoughts? Well, the main problem I have with her is she will never answer the question. Whenever she's confronted, if she has the answer, she won't tell you the answer because at the end of the day, all the policies are bad. They're taking this country in the wrong direction. So when people talk about the word salad in the wrestling business, we call it a bunch of gaga, you know, and it just doesn't mean anything. So when you talk to Trump, you got a feeling, you know, that he's real, he's tangible. He connects with the American people and he loves this country. I've known the guy since WrestleMania four and five, almost 40 years ago. He hasn't changed a bit. He's the same generous, honest guy he was back then. He loves his country, he loves life, and he loves his family. And when he talks about bringing God back into our homes and back to our country and back to our schools, the people understand he's for real. He's sincere about that. <clears throat> what do you make of the Nazi, fascist, racist, I don't know. closing <clears throat> arguments? No, if you guys know, but Hope's got his own beer, too. Real, real American beer. Campaign. That's probably well, what the, a, the shirt a says. You didn't show. And when I went on stage, I said, no, this is the house that Hulkamania built a river. I said, this is Trump mania. I can't remember what I said, but I looked around 22,000 people. I said, I don't see no stinking Nazis in here. You know, I don't see any domestic terrorists. I just see hardworking people, men and women that love this country, that want safety, security. They want, you know, to be, you know, uh, how would I say, be able to pay their bills and get along in life and, and just have a good life in God and country. Just good American, real American people in the building. They're, they're, what they're saying is just spewing venom. It's not true. Yeah, you know, the people that get up every morning, they work hard, uh, obey the laws, they raise their kids, they take them to church, they, they, they cook dinner, uh, pay their taxes. I mean, they're the people that really make the country great. They're the people that that's been your audience your entire career. That's been my audience. And go have a beer career. with Hulk Hogan, real American beer. People that have blessed us. And I hate to see the American dream that we have both benefited from disintegrating before our very eyes. And there's not a single thing they can point to that they can say is successful in my view. Well, when I was talking to the president the other night in the back, I told him I don't buy these polls. I mean, I've been pushing. I don't buy them either. American beer for four months. I've gone to 18 different states. I'm pushing through all 50, and my fans are Democrats and they're Republicans. I see eight to ten thousand people a day. I take pictures, sign autographs. Democrats and Republicans, they're all for Donald Trump. I mean, it's it's so lopsided. Middle America is so lopsided. It's unbelievable. But what you read in the press, demonizing President Trump saying we're all domestic terrorists, talking about- Or Nazis. Nazis. None of that stuff is true. I told Donald Trump, I can't even buy into these polls. 
Don't you believe in either Patriots? We're not Nazis. That's exactly where this is at now. I gotta, I gotta order you a beer online. I have less than a minute. Uh, what is it about that iconic arena? What is it about MSG? Tell me. Well, it's like the Roman Coliseum. If you're an athlete, if you make it Madison Square Garden, you've made it in your career as far as athletics. I mean, the fact that I was in Madison Square Garden for almost 40 years, when I walked out there the other night and I saw 22,000 people, it was the energy of Hulkamania, but it was even bigger. It was like all the Trump God bless you, Hulk Hogan. I follow you on Twitter. And he's got like 2.2 million followers. Follow him, you'll see his real American beer. Yes, we do, Patriot. don't, as the Washington Post said, the American people should not settle for a townhouse instead of a home with a yard. We appreciate you. Thank you, sir. More editing. God bless you. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.